And now, your live Doppler 18 forecast with meteorologist Cameron Hopman. Weather from where you live. Well, rainfall amounts over the last 24 hours show another decent rainfall yesterday. We saw about a third of an inch of rain here at the station, but some parts of Lafayette caught as much as an inch and a quarter. Crawfordsville right around a half an inch, but you go further to the north, some heavier rain right around the white Tippecanoe County border, an inch and a half. Monticello seeing just about four-tenths of an inch of rainfall. Satellite radar, though, will show that rain continuing to move off to our east at this point. High pressure begins to filter in from the northwest, and that's going to keep things clear. But the story right now, stepping out the door, is the fog, dense fog across the viewing area as of now. Visibility right around a mile and a quarter here at the station. We're at 52 degrees. Calm winds, low temperatures, and high humidity contributing to the fog out there this morning. So just a reminder, folks, just drive safely here over the next couple hours. Once the sun rises, some of that fog will begin to burn off, and we're going to be seeing a pretty nice day. But before then, just uh, some pretty dangerous road conditions out there. 55 degrees downtown Lafayette. We're at 52 Monticello, right around 51 degrees, stepping out the door in Remington this morning. Now, Futurecast has things staying clear throughout the day, and that's all thanks to the area of high pressure. Temperatures this afternoon, pretty nice as well. We'll be hitting 72 degrees by your lunch hour, jumping up to 81 by 5 p.m. Mostly sunny skies and those clear conditions stick around during the evening hours as well. 55 overnight tonight winds from the east right around 0 to 5 miles per hour. But that high pressure system will begin to shift to our east tomorrow, and that brings a chance of some southerly winds. That's going to heat things up. We stay clear once again tomorrow. In fact, the near forecast has us staying very clear and dry for at least the next five or so days, but temperatures will be on the rise. That will be the story throughout the rest of the week. We're going to hit 86 degrees for Wednesday by Thursday. We are talking about the 90s making a return. Mostly sunny, certainly warmer. Winds from the south right around 5 to 10 miles per hour for your Wednesday. But check out Thursday right around 90 degrees, your high temperature Thursday afternoon. Friday will be up to 91, 90 on Saturday as well. But another chance of rain finally moves in for Sunday and Monday. The beginning of the, your next work week, temperatures will begin to tail off into the mid-80s. Hopefully, we can cool down a little bit more following that, Jamie. Well, in the meantime, those 90s will make great pool weather for the weekend. Enjoy, you know, the last little bits of summer. Exactly, Jamie. You know, right around mid to late August, hopefully we can see those 80s more and the 70s more rather than the 90s. All right. Thanks so much, Cameron.